Ricky B. De Blair has worked in East London, particularly at the Royal Theatre Stratford, to create a stage where young people can get an opportunity to be themselves and explore and find who they truly are. We will take a listen to the video of some of his work and lifetime. Ricky B. De Blair was born and raised in Camberwell, South London, by his Jamaican mother, from whom he draws much inspiration. From the age of three, Ricky was able to read and directed his first play at aged just 12. It's been written, directed, produced and staged managed by a schoolboy of 12. He's called Ricky, he doesn't go to school anymore and none of his actors goes to school either. Today, he continues to direct many films and theatre productions, including Fit and Free for Leading Equalities charity, Stonewall. Over the past few years, Ricky has directed and run drama sessions at the Theatre Royal in Stratford East, giving young people from the East London communities an opportunity to excel in the arts. In 2014, he published Black and Gay in the UK, a first of its kind, documenting the stories of young black gay youths. Nice to be around, it makes you feel really comfortable. He's like really good, like he acts and directs. Two, three, four. Uh, he's really fun and he's, he's likeable. He smiles all the time, so he's just a lot of fun. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you belong, you fit. The man himself, Mr. Ricky B. De Blair. Oh. Hello, Ricky. Hi, how are you doing? Uh, what are some of the impacts that your work have had on young people, particularly those in East London? Well, East London's been an important thing for me. This well, Stratford East is there. It's, a, it's an area that's traditionally suffered. Um, there's not been much regeneration until um, Canary Wharf, of course, and um, now Stratford. It's kind of a big part of the city that's forgotten and, of course, is now the home for lots and lots of multi-ethnic families from Europe, from Africa, from West Indies, from India, all over Asia. Our next well of creativity is there and so I'm very invested in working there. You've worked in many projects, Ricky, which promotes LGBT and I like the issues as it relates to community members who are lesbian, gay, bisexual or transgendered. Yeah. Um, what are some of those productions and how have they helped to educate uh, and change society's view. Somebody said to me the other day, everything you do is really for black people and gay people, and, and it's not for the white, middle class, heterosexual. And that's not true, it's for everybody. I think the revolution is to show our relevance to everybody, that we have universal outreach and universal impact and universal relevance. We don't only focus on black gay issues, we just include them equally with everybody else and that is a revolution. There might be some young people out there in East London and in the UK at large yeah. who might be suffering from the stereotypes of being gay, the bullies, and need help and support. Mm -hmm. What advice can you offer those who want to follow their dream but at the breaking point where a challenge stands in the way and they may feel that they want to give up? Remember that the power is with you and do what you want to do regardless of whether people accept it or not. Don't ask for permission. No one has the right to give you permission to be an artist or to be gay or to be straight or to be... No one, ha no one has that right. No one ha and you shouldn't burden anybody with that right. So don't give your parents power over you. Don't give your, your lovers power over you. Don't give the bullies or the people in the street power over you. They can't handle it. The only, only opinion that matters um, is your own and the only thing that can limit you is yourself so keep that power decide to be reborn every single day thank you so much Ricky thank you and maybe wish you all the best uh, thank you. with forthcoming projects thank and you. ongoing projects thank you I wish you the best for yours thank you and there you have it uh, <laughs> Mr Ricky Bieda Blair just empowered you the power is in your hands you've got to take charge of your own life and lead it the way you see it fit get all the help and advice you want. Search online for an internet age. Thank you so much, Rising East TV. See you soon.